Hey guys, welcome back to SNS Outdoors. So, uh, today we're just gonna be doing a little bit of, like, I don't wanna say pest control, but uh, we're, go we're going after, see here if, I can, if you can see that. Right there. See, come on, focus. Well, in case you couldn't tell what that was, that was a squirrel. You can see him playing around over there. That's right, but, but there's squirrels behind. They're up oh, there, they are, they're playing. So, my neighbor, my neighbor asked me to, uh, mess with the squirrels so uh, this is what we're gonna be taking care of today uh, I came out here yesterday <clears throat> to get this pellet gun from Isaac who you guys have seen in previous videos and as I was out here there was one right over here by this tree and I shot it um, I don't have that on video now we're gonna try and see if we can actually shoot one on camera I think I shot under him, but he's coming back, so it's okay. Literally just turned off the camera, and there's one right there. Just freaking turn the camera off. I don't know what that one hit, left, right, anything, I don't know. He's coming down. Got him. Got him. Nice. I'm gonna go over there, finish him off real quick, I guess. Because that's how we do it around here. One down, like 30 to go. Alright ladies and gentlemen, it's been about, let's say two hours since I was out there last. I came in, did some cleaning up around the house. Because most of you may not know, me and my girlfriend got our own place now. Yeah, so, <sighs> real quick to work. That's all you get for now, sorry. But, uh. Champ, come say hi. Sit. Champ, sit. Sit down. Are you listening? Hey. Sit. Good boy. Stay. Yeah, stay in here. I just took your body. So we're going to go take care of his squirrels again. Uh, I ended up, I only ended up getting that one this morning, but it's okay. Cause I got that one yesterday as you guys have seen and then whatever we do now so 
We won't be getting back in time for Isaac to come. Uh, if so, I'll probably let him take a couple crack shots at some squirrels. If not, we'll have to stop whenever uh, Brianna gets home. But yeah, let's see what's down here. Oh, there's one right there. Okay. Oh, there's two. Three, four. Okay. Well. Okay. That's what we like to see. There's one right there. There's a couple around this little corner. That's what we're going to go for, I guess, since he's just uh, staying in there, so let's go ahead and try and set you up so you can see all right. That's good enough for me. Wait for him to turn around and we'll bust him. Boom. Told you guys Isaac would show up. Yeah. We went over there to show him where I shot the first one today. Oh. And that squirrel ran off out of that tree, which we walked right by. I guess it didn't see us walk out. Ran into that tree right there. No, it ran into the oak. Oh, we were, ran, uh, well, it ran around the oak. You know what? I just said he didn't see it go up, so maybe we can get. Oh, is that his head sticking out, or is that not on the tree? I think it's not on the tree. Yeah. You can always zoom in and see. I guess I could. Because it is a gray squirrel. Oh man. What happened to your arm, Isaac? Uh, so in welding, we're doing three quarter inch plate with a three sixteenths backing strip. And I'm doing dual shield flux core 045 wire at, you know, pretty toasty temperatures. And it takes about 30 minutes to fill up a little six inch weld and you got but i'm doing two plates at the same time and it literally burnt my leather so much and heated my arm up so much that it's now blistering yeah buddy and also overheated my helmet to the point where it actually shut off on me your helmet like the lens yeah like it went from an auto dark to nothing oh i didn't know that was even a thing that makes two of us Oh, ran off down that way. However, here's some more. Well, here are the trees. Where is it at? I'm not sure where I'm just trying. Oh. I think I just saw it. There's one. Yep, there's one up there. I don't think I got a good shot on any of them. Yep, but then there's one right here in this tree. It's on the back side. Yep, see? Oh, never mind. It's a bird. Never mind. See, oh, there he is. If we come right here, we might be coming down the stream. We might be able to see him come down. Come down. I mean, he's staying up there, Tim. So the best bet is just walking in. He was in this tree when I saw him last. Mm -hmm. I saw him running down. There he is, right there. On that tree. See him? On the ground? No, on the tree. Here, trade me.
Still a squirrel. Oh, he's on the ground. Yeah. He ran down and deeper into the woods, though. Okay. And so we're just walking up over here. Let's go nice and slow. Make sure there ain't nobody over here yet. Because last time we walked over here, well, the time before, actually, there was. So, think nice and so. I'm not out here as early as I was yesterday, though. About an hour later than I was yesterday. Which is fine, there's no squirrels over here, so. I'll go ahead and just set up. Let's see if we can see any blood, I guess. See me out of here. Probably. This is about a trip. Here, where was he when we shot? It's about right here, so looks like that's where I hit the tree. You can see that right there. I don't know. So now the question is, did I miss him? I'm just scare him? It looks like he climbed up that tree all funny. I'm not seeing any blood anywhere. That's fine. He'll come back down. And we'll get him. I was waiting for a shot of him to get on the ground, but it didn't look like he was going to get on the ground. So what we'll do is we'll come over here. We'll set up kind of like we did yesterday, yesterday morning. A hug in this bush.
got him. Alright y'all, so what I think happened, right? And I'm, there he is, I'm covering him up now, so... This gun's got a tendency of shooting off, left or right, because it's smooth bore, which means it's got no rifling in it to help it be um, more accurate. And so like, I've got the... I don't know what you want to say, like... The up and down, like, spot on. But like, left and right is just kind of... Depends on what you get on that shot, like how the wind's doing and stuff like that. So what I think happened was when I shot him the first time, he shot to the right. Okay, and I think I shot him more or less in the side. Okay, shot him in the side. Not in like any of the bones or anything, so that's why he was able to crawl up there, but like crawl up there weird, you know what I mean? So what happened was he fell down out of the tree limb and caught himself there. And he out there for a couple minutes. And then I saw him crawl his way back up, and I was like, man, I could see him the whole time, but I couldn't shoot through all that stuff. So I was like, how about I go over there and look and see if I can see him? So that's why I brought the gun over there. So I was walking around, walking around, walking around, walking around, didn't see nothing, didn't see nothing, didn't see nothing. And I was walking around this way, and I was about... And then there's a squirrel over there. Anyways, I was about to head over and he lost his footing on a tree, fell down, and fell right there. And that's when you see me in the video. Oh, I started grabbing my gun and walking around, walking around. Well, he climbed around the back of this tree. So I was like, okay, he's not moving that fast. So like, he, I got here. And he was hanging out right there. And I was like, oh, I'm going to shoot him. And then he whoops around the tree real quick. Oops, sorry. He whoops around the tree real quick. But as I said, he can't hold on very good. So he fell. Boom. Right there. Knocked the wind out of himself. And he was like, uh, uh. And I was like, oh, poor guy. So I was going to put him out of his misery. Dude starts running off right. Freaking just, meh. And I'm like, nope, not happening today. So I stand here. You can probably see it on my video, actually. And I just lead my shot, hit him. Right where I was aiming, right behind the front shoulder. But um, since, I mean, come on guys, it's a BB gun. It's not gonna penetrate all the way to the heart. So he uh, starts crawling again. I just walk over there, shoot him by the head. Done. So I mean, yeah, I mean, like, that's a pretty good shot. Right behind the front shoulder there. Oh, right behind the front shoulder there, so. Usually where it should be done at. But, uh, yeah, well, I think that's going to be all for this video. Um, I got to go do some grocery shopping now, so that'll probably be it. Uh, stay tuned for two cooking videos. I'll do the um, cleaning on all of them on one video, but then I'll do the biscuits and gravy video for one and then I'll do the barbecue coon, not barbecue coon we already did that one barbecue squirrel on another one um, with Isaac so we'll probably do the probably do the barbecue squirrel first though probably do that one first and then the following day or the day after we'll do the Squirrel biscuits and gravy because I'm going to the store to eat like biscuits and gravy stuff. So, yeah. Well, thank you guys for tuning in and we'll catch you later.